Good morning, peoples. Okay, the birds are chirping. Okay, uh, good morning, peoples. We are on the way to the doctor. So it is Tuesday, June 19th, and I have a follicle scan and, and probably, probably IUI today. Um, I, a couple weeks ago, after my cycle started and, um, IUI 3 was not successful, I went through, like, my stash of pregnancy tests, ovulation tests, and all that, and the little strips, oh god, it's bright, the little strips that I normally use, um, pretty much the, the entirety of my remaining strips were all expiring in June, so, um, I wasn't sure if I was really going to get to use them before the cycle or if I did use them, if they were even going to be any good because it just said June, it didn't give it a specific. So I passed those along to somebody else, um, with a couple of pregnancy tests that might have been able to use them. So this cycle, um, I did not use any ovulation strips because I forgot that I gave them all away. I thought I had a couple extras in my defense. I really did, but... I don't. So and by the time you remembered, it was yeah. By the time I remembered, it was Sunday. Sunday. So it was like there would have been no, there would have been no time basically. So the only test that I used was my digital test. I took it one time last night. Got a peek. And that's that. So there's really been no time to analyze everything. No time to stress. Maybe that's a good thing. It's kind of nice. I gotta be honest. I kind of I'm kind of enjoying it. Okay, so. And I was getting coffee real quick before we head back to the house. Um, I got a positive ovulation test last night. I've had some serious ovulation pains. Had them last night. Kind of gone away since since then. Um, and we did an ultrasound this morning. And my largest follicle is only a 14. So... Um, we did a progesterone draw to see if, um, like, I, see if I've already ovulated. She said she didn't see anything that looks like I've already ovulated that, um, is probably just not ready. She said that they don't really put a lot of stock in OPKs because you can get a false reading. It's not 100% accurate. Um, so I don't really know, like, where my brain is right now because I've never had that happen. Like, it's cycle day 14. I'm medicated. We've never really had that happen where we go in or I've gotten a positive test and I don't have, like, a mature follicle. Um, we've got one that is definitely dominant in terms of it's the largest follicle, but nothing that's showing I'm about to ovulate, so... Um, so we're looking at the progesterone. I, she did that draw this morning and she's going to call me back in a little while after they've run it and tell me what day to come back. So we told her that, um, I've had like some serious follicle growth in the past that I've gone from like 14 to like 20 in two days. So they wanted to bring me back originally Friday, but she said it may be Thursday. They're just going to review everything with the doctor. So keep you guys updated and let you guys know what the deal is, but that's kind of where we're at right now. So, um, if you're not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and hit the subscribe button and click the bell button down below so you don't miss when we post a new video. There'll probably be at least one more this week, so just kind of keep an eye on that, and I will get with you guys next time. Thanks so much for watching. Bye, guys. Okay, guys, um, a change of plans. So, I know you just uh, saw that we were not um, inseminating today, that um, my follicle was... Not ready, but my nurse just called me back and my doctor just said that um, my progesterone was 3.7. So we could have caught ovulation like right now, um, like as it's happening. So um, they want me to come back. So I'm trying to get an eye on the phone, been trying to call her, she's not answering. So we can go back because they want to do the insemination today. Like, right now. So, I'm about to get ready. I'm about to go hopefully get a hold of Anaya. And then we are going to go and try for IUI number four. Ooh, wish us luck. You're a little impatient, aren't you? 
I am. Cause don't nobody know how to drive today. So we are back at the fertility specialist. Um, so you just, you guys just saw my little frantic moment. Um, after the nurse called me, I called her job. I called her. I FaceTimed her. I texted her and sent her a Hangouts on Google Hangouts. Oh, me? Yes. I was like, you sent her. Never I called, I called, I'll tell you a minute and how I called your office. It was a mess up. Anyway, we're back at the Fertility Institute. We called, name? she called me less than an hour ago. So from phone call to now, about right at about an hour a little less than an hour so we're gonna go in and get this iui done i was in the meeting i'm sorry fingers crossed y'all fingers crossed baby best is um, dr butler gonna be okay with this recording um i don't think so okay right. we normally have dr hoffman so yeah i don't want she doesn't mind but yeah this Hello. Hello. How are you? Good. Yep. Tina does most of these. We've got good camera. I'm good. What? Tina. <laughs> <laughs> really good. I know. I asked you. That was my prediction. So I need your signature there. Yep. Good job. And we'll show you this I is the right one. That. That's <laughs> it. Six, seven, four, four. Yes. We're pros at this. Mm -hmm. Well, let's make it work. So. so. That was a whirlwind. It's definitely a much different experience. So, the doctor who normally does my IUIs is on vacation. And the doctor that we had knocked the recording down. <laughs> so, we have no footage. We yep. have audio, but we have he no, sure enough, no footage. And I mean, it was like propped up like this, and he went... Like, oh. He didn't slam it shut. He just pushed it out of the way. No, he he. I'm telling you, he went like this, and then moved it. <laughs> like, okay. Bum, so bum, bum. No video for us. And he didn't let an eye push it in. No. And watch, this is gonna be the time that works. It's just different, you know. Just a different. Thing. It's okay. The sacrifices that we make. So. He said that not the greatest follicle ever. I don't really know. It's. We're, we're just gonna wait and see that's really all we can do same so yeah <laughs> i don't really know what else this cycle's been like so different than all of our other cycles so i don't really know kind of where to go with this so anyway we're gonna leave here maybe have some lunch oh or we're some, having or some ice cream or something rumbling. um if you haven't already subscribed subscribe to my channel so you can see what's going on hit the bell button so you don't miss when we upload a new video and that's all i got for today you got anything else want to add no leave leave baby dust in the comments below true that thank you guys so much for watching and we will catch you guys next time